told you guys we'd be back today and I'm back with product. We have more parts and things going on. Yeah. We have more parts, so while uh, Justin's having his homie polish his turd over here, trying to make it look pretty. Look at this run. See this? Matches the ones in your undies. Wow, dude, you're savage. I got jokes. <laughs> okay, well, Kurt's working on the car. But anyways, I got coilovers from BC. So shout out to BC Racing. Uh, I've always wanted a set of BCs. I've suggested them to friends for years. They're affordable. They're fully, fully custom. Um, when you order a set of coils from BC, I'm gonna show you guys how this works. You get a little card with all your specs checked off, right? And the person that built it signs down below. So shout out to Chris. I'm pretty sure it says Chris. Shout out to Chris for building these coilovers for me. The fronts are a uh, 10K spring rate. The rears are a 6K. And they are linear style uh, drift spec BR series coilover. So make sure to uh, hit the link below to pick up a set of coils from BC. Follow them on Instagram. I'll put it right here. And then I had to go to eBay to find some headlights for the car. And I think these ones will do just fine for 100 and. $39 or whatever they cost Super affordable. I think they're gonna look great and then my hood So now we have a complete front end and it'll give Kurt the, uh, the Opportunity to start fitting everything after the cage is done for the front end And tomorrow all my front steering is going to be here, so wise fab, tie rods, all that shit. So today, I'll be dropping the front subframe to clean that up. God damn it, if that happens one more time, I'm going to freak out. To clean everything up, and maybe we'll throw these coils on. I'm not sure yet. <laughs> we'll watch Justin trying to fucking fix his car. I don't know. A lot of you yesterday in the comments were talking about how Tone and I need to link up and do a video when he's here. So I talked with Tone and it's gonna happen. He's gonna be here next Friday. We're gonna do something cool. If you guys missed yesterday's video, this is Skyline, so R33 with an RB25. It just got a full cage. I'll show it to you guys in case you missed yesterday's video. Yeah, it looks really good. And the door bars. Shit. Door bars say stay shitty, which is dope. Somebody's calling me. All right, so thanks to Justin and Shane. We've just been cutting and taking everything out of here. As you can see, the subframe's out now. And the subframe's on the ground. I gotta pull the steering rack out. Paint the subframe. Sorry, it's really loud. Subframe's out. I'm gonna clean, clean it up. Everything else is gonna be taken out of here. It's all this random bullshit. All the stock brake lines are gone, stock clutch line. All these holes will be patched. We don't have, this looks crazy. Dude, that's my throttle cable. How will I do burnouts? Uh, my bad. It's cool. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I'm not gonna use that one though. <laughs> if you cut it, you have to buy me a new one. No. If, I need it, if I need a new one and I can't afford it, <laughs> will you buy it? How much money do you have? Enough to party. Do you? Enough every night of the week. Do you party every night of the week? Some people can't know that. What are you doing, dude? Trying to sneak up on me. Yeah, what's up, dude? This is my gang right here, gang gang. Uh, <laughs> so that's it for today. I'm tired. I'm not really doing anything. I'm going to clean up my mess that's accumulated here over the last few days so that Kurt can move around and work on my car. Party and food. yeah, we're gonna go get some food. I don't know what else I'm gonna do today. Um, I'm waiting on the Wise Fab stuff to get here tomorrow. Still not even sure if I'm gonna put that on straight away just because the two fronts still have to get done and the whole engine bay has to get painted. I mean, it's white right now, and, and the video doesn't look too bad other than like that, but it needs a respray. And the, in, the interior needs to be sprayed, and the cage needs to be sprayed. So we'll just see what happens. Blue, what are you doing? Yeah. So we're gonna get out of here soon. 
I just want to give a huge shout out to BC Racing for the coilovers and all the support for 2017. And make sure to check out their website, link below. Pick up a set of coilovers, pick up a shirt, whatever. And uh, Level Ride is busy. But there's a few projects about to be done and out of the shop, so there's room for one of you guys to come in here and get a cage, get a hydro, whatever you guys need done. Um, here's some of the, the brackets that bolt to your factory uh, shifter boot holes on your tunnel, and the uh, e-brake will sit right here. It looks great. I can't wait to show you guys when we uh, when we put mine in. I did a video a while ago if you guys are curious about their uh, hydro setup. We did one on my S13. I'll actually put the video to that in the description so you can see how it works. Holler at them. The website's linked below. And yeah, maybe, maybe we'll do something else. I don't know. Alright, so I'm going with all radium engineering stuff uh, for my fuel system. And I'm here now. So we're going to walk inside and give you guys a look at some of the stuff I'll be running into. All right, so this is this is just a little showroom um, here. They're located in Clackamas, which is super dope. It's always nice to work with uh, local companies if there's ever any issues or um, just need to grab something real quick. I can always just come in here. Aaron will be here, and he's actually just going over kind of the setup that I'll be running on the new car, and uh, I'm really excited. Really excited. I can't pick up the fuel cell today because obviously fuel safe is the people that, um, that make it and he'll send out one of their surge tanks and we'll all get put together, sent back, right, and then we can just put it in, mm -hmm. essentially. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to grab some stuff today and uh, after I get done talking with him, I'll show you guys what I get. When you do that, you'll be doing something kind of like this. Oh yeah, that's perfect. So. The way we built this, this is just our test bench. Yeah. Oh, still covered in fluid. <laughs> um, but basically, this is the uh, remote fill neck, which is this guy. Mm -hmm. It has like a little barb on it, so you can slip this tubing over. This stuff is available from Summit Racing or oh, whatever. Oh, yeah, yeah. It's just two and a quarter ID. Okay. Um, then we, we made a little cap by bolting two of the uh, remote fill necks together with a gasket. So you can um, do something similar, or you can oh, that looks do good whatever. Right there. But uh, that's just something we threw together for this test. I mean, and it's machine. not it's not really anything crazy, you know what I mean? You're yeah. just putting fuel in here in the yeah, cell, exactly. yeah. So cool. That's that. So cool. we could set you up with something like that. Okay. In fact, if you need hose, I, I have some extra. All right, we got a box of goodies here. This isn't everything. Um, the cell has to be custom made. But do me a favor, follow Radium Engineering on Instagram. I'll put it right here. Give them a follow. They're located here in Portland, Oregon. Their uh, website will be linked below. So if you guys need anything for your drift cars, road race cars, they cater to everything. Holler at them. You got to support a local Northwest brand like this. The product is insane. I can't, like, the quality of the product, just the way it looks. It just looks cool. Does that make sense? You know what I mean? There's a lot of good product out there that doesn't look cool, but it is good. And they have really, really figured out how to make a good quality product look nice. Watch out, dude. Why are you standing behind me, dude? Watch out. All right, dude, we're out. Thank you so much for everything. Enjoy. Yep, will do. I got a box of goodies. Oh, me too. I'm going to spill this. Drop that. This makes good for good content. Got a one year warranty, but not if you break it. <laughs> not if I break it before I walk out the front door. <laughs> yeah. Later, dude. Thank you. All right, guys, that is going to do it for today's video. Huge shout out to BC Racing. Huge shout out to Radium Engineering. I have been such a fan of both these brands' products for such a long time, and I've never really been in a position to, uh, to be able to purchase them or work with them in any way. So, huge thank you to Aaron. Huge thank you to Cody. Aaron at Radium, Cody at BC, you guys are awesome. And uh, yeah, this car is finally coming together, the parts are finally showing up, and it's gonna start looking like a race car here very soon. So make sure to subscribe, that way you get the notifications when these videos drop, and you see the updates and the progress on the build. And uh, a couple more months and we'll be doing burnouts. So, see you guys next time. Thanks for watching, peace.